is up, Trauma Alert Nation. I'm your host, Keller Keemstar. Let's get right into the news. Guys, we were going to upload an interview with Jake Paul's neighbor last night because there was crazy shit going on in the neighborhood. And that got pushed back to later this week. So that's why I didn't upload at midnight. But I did upload a video yesterday talking about Rice Gum and FaZe Banks trying to fight Team 10 because Team 10 showed up at Rice Gum's house. If you haven't seen the video from last night, make sure you watch that. But this is a follow up to that because even more shit went down. Rice Gum uploaded a video titled Team 10 Members Come to My House. And in the video, Rice Gum is pissed. He says he's going to throw down. Roll it. Want to talk or you want to fight? I don't know what you guys want from me, but when you guys pulled up to the crib, this internet beef drama, whatever, like, is not even internet beef anymore. Like, you guys are making it real life beef, and I'm not just a kid that can just type, you know, mean things on the internet. Like, no, I'm about it in person too, so what are you trying to do? Because you know I got the gym at the crib, so pull up. I'm ready. And guys, I tweeted at him, like, yo, come through, and this is what he said. What do you, if he comes to me, I'm gonna slap the Woo! Now this is what I don't understand. Chance and Anthony, all right? You originally went to Rice Gum's house to show him how to be a man. He wasn't home, and now Rice Gum and Face Banks have invited you to come back to the house multiple times on Twitter in this video from Rice Gum. Where's the fight? Where's the fight? Is Team 10 pussying out of this fight? Like Chance and Anthony, you were all about it. You showed up to their house to fight them. How come you're not going there now? I'm just saying that seems like some bitch shit. Now we have more Team 10 news, but before we get into that, let's talk about this Sidemen war. That's right, we're talking about KSI versus Ethan from the Sidemen. Ethan, yesterday, uploaded a diss track on KSI. The diss track was titled Drama KSI Rice Gum Diss Track. And even I was mentioned in this diss track and I had nothing to do with it. I swear I am innocent. All I did is found a picture of KSI's new girlfriend that he didn't want anyone to see and I tweeted out a picture where you couldn't even identify her. But anyhow, here's a clip from that diss track. Roll it. You're delusional. Took a break from the channel to confuse them all. In reality, you lied. Took the wrong side and now we're sending tickets to your funeral. Yeah. Chatting shit about Emily. I showed my girlfriend. But where's yours? No way. Only got a leaked team star pick. Are you afraid of showing her flaws? Damn! I didn't know Ethan even had it in him. That was a pretty decent diss track for someone that doesn't rap. After that came out, Vic Star tweet it at KSI saying L. Now everybody should know that KSI is going to fire back with his own diss track. In fact, some of it got leaked on his Snapchat last night. Here is what we have. Roll it. Tell me that shit. How much wood can a woodchuck chuck if the woodchuck look like you, bitch? I'ma have fun with the nigga here done. You the woodchuck, woodchuck, none. Think you're a big man with a shit dick, man. I'm a kick, kick, clack. Now listen, even though that KSI and Sidemen seem to be fighting with each other, there are so many YouTubers that are saying that this is all fake, this is just a publicity stunt, but I reached out to my good friend JJ in the DMs and I straight up asked him. I was like, just be honest. Is this fight real or is it fake? And KSI responded by saying, but yeah, shit ain't fake. See, not everyone really knows this, but uh, JJ and Ethan have fought a lot in the past. Not always public, but the two aren't really best friends. So I personally am gonna have to just believe what KSI says. This beef is real. Also in the news, Jake Paul's recent music video titled Jake Paul YouTube Stars Diss Track Official Music Video. This music video is getting a ton of hate. Right now it has 286,000 dislikes. And not only are just random people hating on it, Seth Rogen, the famous actor, took another dig at Jake Paul. Lizard Queen tweeted out, I have discovered apology raps are apparently Jake Paul's thing, linking the apology rap that he did with his brother. And that's when Seth Rogen quoted the tweet and said this, Jake Paul apology raps are my new favorite genre of music. <laughs> 
And now for our final story. Ladies and gentlemen, we need answers. On the last drum alert, we reported that Jake Paul's neighbor over at the Team 10 house found a pair of pants with shit in them, with diarrhea, with poop. And in those pants, they found an ID of Chance from Team 10. We need the answers. I have DM'd Nick Crumpton, asking him how these poopy pants got in the neighbor's yard. And he refuses to give me an answer. I DM Jake Paul, no answer. We need to get to the bottom of this. And if you want to get to the bottom of this, all you have to do is slap a like on this video, subscribe with notifications on, because we are going to dig forever to get these answers because there are all these questions in the world. Where do babies come from? Where is the city of Atlantis? But I feel the most pressing question that faced humanity in the 21st century is did chance Poo his pants. Put that hashtag out on Twitter and help me find the answers. And Jake Paul, if you could help me sign off with this video. Man, where was your Chance pooped his pants. Chance pooped his pants. Man, where was your Chance pooped his pants. Chance pooped his pants. Chance pooped his pants. <laughs>